Unicorn N as in Nancy. As in Nancy. <laughs> Just so or we don't forget. N as in Navi. Kingdom. So we got here at 6:45. Park opens at 8. We just assumed they'd probably start letting us line up around 7, so we wanted to get in here quick early. We like to be here early. Um as many times as we've rope dropped, we have never had to circle around or sit on the side of the road to wait for them to open the parking lot up. This is day two of this. What's going on? Like, I don't know. Like, I know there's not extra magic hours or anything, but when extra magic hours was going on, we'd still get to the park over an hour early. But, um, I don't know. Maybe it's still a little short staffed. I just thought it was really crazy. It was, <laughs> people were acting crazy. I thought maybe there was gonna be a wreck because it was like lined up down the highway. But um, they finally let us in. It is 7.14 and uh, we parked in Unicorn as in Navi. No, Unicorn <laughs> row in as in Navi. Unicorn, wait, what? What did I say? You said Unicorn as in Navi. <laughs> unicorn in. <laughs> oh gosh. But um, we're walking in. It's a very, very beautiful morning, but it is muggy. It was dark and just gross when we walked out of the hotel. But, um, we're about to have us a good morning. But, uh, first, we gotta get in the park. You guys have a good one. Decided this is my favorite park. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so where are we headed? Uh, Pandora, obviously. Flight obviously. of Passage. Duh. Where all of these people are headed as well. <laughs> okay, so I knew that they was going to do this. Um, they've got us stopped up here at the bridge before you get into Pandora. And they are going to basically walk us probably the 7.30 mark, which we have uh, not too long. All right, so I was almost right. It's uh, two minutes earlier than I thought. So we just finished Flight of Passage and it's it's just always such a good ride to go on. Um, I've never had a bad experience on that ride and I do love the rides that pump in those smells like Soren and here. It just gives it that extra experience and enjoyment. Um, plus I also like the, the, like the Savannah smells and stuff like that so good job. Um, anyways, we it didn't take long, about 30 minutes to get in and out. It's a little bit after 8 now. I think it's like 7 minutes after 8, so the park is officially now fully open. 
Uh, I don't really know where we're going. I'm probably going to go to Joffrey's and get some coffee and then head over to Asia and kind of see what's going on over there. But uh, let me go find Samantha and get back to it. I just cannot stress enough how much I love Animal Kingdom Park. It's the sounds. It's the beauty of the trees and foliage and just looks very natural plus it's very shaded which is also a good thing too it doesn't have in my opinion some of the blockbuster rides now some people may argue that expedition everest is probably the best coaster here and i would disagree with them so you've got flight of passage you've got expedition everest uh, some people like dinosaur it's an okay ride um and then you've got the kalimanjaro safari tour which is which is always fun. We don't do it very often. But anyways, ooh, the sun's out. Oh, but yes, this park, I just cannot stress enough how gorgeous it is. And you, you really can't explain it until you see it. So if you ever have an opportunity to come and you only have one park to choose, well, obviously choose Magic Kingdom because that's the most iconic park. But if you have a second one, definitely give this one a go you will not be disappointed. Let's go get some coffee. All right. All right, so, well, we made it to Asia and got our Joffreys. Um, wow, that's hot. Samantha wanted the nitro cold brew, but they didn't have any nitrogen. So, so uh, I got some hot coffee. Yeah, she just got some hot coffee. But anyways, normally we'll sit right next to Yak and Yeti uh, local cafe and watch the monkeys or whatever they are swing and I don't really know what the correct name for them are. <laughs> we just call them monkeys. Uh, we just call them monkeys. And uh, enjoy ourselves behind the uh, Yak and Yeti local cafe. But anyways, I don't really know where we're next to, but we are sitting basically, well, they ain't no basically to us. We're sitting by ourselves with a beautiful view of the Tree of Life. And I'll show you guys exactly where we're sitting the owl from our table. Yes, you can see the owl. What is that? Um, meerkats and all kinds of stuff. Oh, there's a fish. And a dolphin. And an iguana. Oh. <laughs> yep, yeah, so this is where we're sitting. Um, absolutely stunning view. It is, again, uh, what month are we in? August, yeah. It's August in Florida, so. You're just gonna hear us complain about the muggy, hot, it's not hot, it's just gross. I feel so gross. I got ready this morning, and I just don't even know why I tried. Yes, the humidity is off the charts, and we live in Mississippi, and we're used to this, but, I don't know. This is like a different degree. Maybe we were expecting well, we, a little bit better. We sit in though. the air condition all day long. You sit in the air condition all day long. I sit in the air condition all day long. Normally I have a sweater on by this point in the day. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. But anyways, uh, we're going to enjoy our coffee and then get back to exploring the most beautiful theme park in the world. Animal Kingdom. Yeah. I want an otter to take home. Like, Remy needs an otter buddy. I agree, he does. Yes. Look how cute they are. 
We could probably come here later today and see these guys running around, swimming. Um, this is my, like my favorite, I think this is my favorite exhibit in Animal Kingdom. Hey, what is that? I don't think that, oh my gosh, that is the shark catfish. Whoa, he's huge. Oh my gosh. They're freshwater fish, and the only reason that they are called shark is because they look like a shark. They're not actually sharks, they're catfish. They patrol the murky bottom of rivers and lakes, always on the prowl for crustace what? Crust crustaceans and other small aquatic life. I These are these size catfish that people go noodling for. Like they stick their arm in the hole and pull it out with their arms. Oh my gosh, no. Yeah, you would never see me. I don't do like fish like anyway, so like I don't want to get in water and feel the fish on my toes. Ugh. She's got jokes. She's got jokes, everyone. And what do we walk up to? A duck. Well, we're supposed to see lemurs, but there's like four, five, four ducks and a crane guy. Okay, so a cast member just asked if we saw the lemur. We didn't. We were just thinking that it was asleep. She said it's over here. I've been waiting on those all morning. Okay, so we've seen this show from afar, never actually watched it. Guys, I literally had tears in my eyes. Like, I don't know. It was sweet. I loved it. I'm gonna cry again. So we are at Rufiki's Planet Watch. I'm about to go in here, this ice box. Thank you. 